This is Catholic Daily Reflections for January 3rd. Today's reflection is entitled, Behold the Lamb of God. Behold the Lamb of God, who takes away the sin of the world. These familiar words of St. John the Baptist offer us a beautiful meditation. They are spoken every time we attend Mass when the priest holds up the sacred host. These words, spoken first by John as Jesus came to him to be baptized, are words that can be prayerfully meditated upon throughout our lives. Think about that statement. Behold the Lamb of God. It's good to start by imagining John speaking these words of Jesus. But from there, we apply them to the Eucharist and to countless other moments in our daily lives. When John first spoke these words, the Lamb of God was seen in a very ordinary way. The eyes of all present saw only an ordinary man approaching the scene. But the eyes of faith saw he who would give his life for the salvation of the world as the sacrificial lamb. And when we look at the sacred host, as it is held up at Mass for all to see, we see Jesus, the sacrificial lamb, in an even more veiled way. We see with our eyes a piece of bread. But with the eyes of faith, once again, we behold the Savior. The sacrificial Lamb of God is continually coming to us throughout our day. He is all around us, coming to us in veiled form, revealing himself in faith. Do you see him? How is it that you are being called this day to behold his divine and sacrificial presence? How is he present in acts of selfless charity? How does he come to you each day, and how does he desire you to bring him to others each day? Reflect today upon those sacred words. Behold the Lamb of God. Seek him out, expecting his divine presence to be veiled but real. Discover him with the eyes of faith and rejoice as he draws near. Let us pray. Lord, I behold your divine presence today and every day. I seek you and love you. Give me the eyes of faith to discover your real but hidden presence at all times. You are all around me every day. Help me to rejoice in how near you always are. Jesus, I trust in you.